Hello everybody and welcome back to the Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. I am Rufal, playing this game for you. Woo! And just like before, we will need to climb we will need to climb the side in order to get some keys. And other necessary stuff for progressing. But uh there's a lot more spiders. And they're out of range. So we'll need something that can go get them. Right. There's another spider that can be hit with that trajectory, but uh, that one's kind of... Hmm. I think I hit the root. Going up. Excellent. Climb, boy! And hopefully don't don't get noticed by that spider up there. Punk. Oh. Aha. Thank you. Now we can go inside. What do we have in here? More spiders. And there's one more spider, too. A lot better hidden. Well, this is familiar. Things are slightly different in this room, but, uh, not that much. In general, all that does is limit our options. Because we can't make our way into the courtyard until we have the bow. So we'll just come this way. Song of Time blocks are getting excessive, though. I mean, what purpose did that block there even serve? It's not appearing on the other side. It's, it's not part of any puzzle. It's just wasting time. Next. Hey, buddy. Come here. Fight me. Cool. That will be useful. Let's grab hold of our nuts. No, not like that. Come on, people. And we'll head this way, because it's the only way left. Punk. Not sure this narrow field, uh, but this narrow fighting area is, uh, helps you. Yeah. Can't speak. Okay, and wait. Huh? Right. What do we got over here? Aha! Well, let's head forward, then. Come on up. Ah, oh, the arrows are back, are they? Let's see. Clock. Wait a second. 
The arrows lie. Right, we'll have to do something a little different. First things first, though. Gotta get this thing out of the way. That should be far enough. I will just push you into place. Aha! Shove! Great. Before we go up, though, head on up the ladder. Because all is not well in the kingdom. There's nothing over there, so don't worry about it. In order to push this one, so we need to pull it. That should be far enough. In fact, that should be a little too far. I think it only needs to be pulled six times, but... Eight is definitely safe. Yep. This one could move. You pulled the other one far enough. Huzzah! And then we have a switch. What's this for? That is a shortcut. We were expected to go through this room um, so many times that they provided us with a shortcut. Oh, goody. Out of the way, you. However, we'll just circum... We'll just, uh... Get rid of the need for the shortcut by placing our own. Aha! Now, before we move into this next room... Open up! Quickly! The Ball Master's coming! Hooray! Let's get out of here. And play with the Floor Master. Don't fall into the courtyard yet. <laughs> we don't have any business there yet. Let's come in here and uh, watch your left. Catch! Another key for the road. I'll just head out this way. That spider you hear is in the other room. Flip the switch to twist up the hall. And then at this point we can make use of the shortcut by grappling over to there. Can reach it from the floor. Climbing up there, and then up to there, and the rest of the way to, to the top. I prefer the expressway. But of course, we're not done with it yet.
Yes, Navi. Wall Masters. I got it. This part is exactly like before. But we're gonna need our bow to deal with any ghosts. Come here, sir. Next. Come on. Away with you! Right. What's in the box? Good stuff's in the box. Yay! All right, let's go through the blue door. Now, just like before, the other end of this of the stairwell is is a locked door. So we're just here to play with the ghost. Come get me. Sucker! Aha! Map for the compass, place your bets. You bet cusp compass. Aha! Hooray! Now he has some vague idea of where I am in the room. Yes, yes, it's very funny. Get that punk. Now you'll be up here. Our map. Now, let's get going. Back to the warp point. Which we still aren't done with. Pardon me, sir. Aha! Don't. Right. Well, the only thing of major value is right up here. And then it's down into the well. Now, if you have the golden scale, you can just 
dive down and in. Though you do need the golden scale, the silver one won't cut it. Otherwise, make use of the iron boots. The golden scale will let you dive deep enough to uh, come under here and then make your way up on the other side. And while there is a chest down here, we actually can't open it while it's underwater. Figures. So, we float. How do we drain the well? Does that tell you? As a point of note, going through the well is not necessary because we could just go into the main room and use our bow to open up to open up the doorways. But yeah, this is a little bit faster. <laughs> Down boy. Well, we've gotten one key. That's not enough. We need two keys before we go back. Aha! And in order to get that other key, we need the Song of Time. And we need it again. Fortunately, a block you're standing on will not react to the song. Some blocks just don't react at all. Up onto the balcony! Hooray! Now, this room over here serves no purpose. It's a shorter path between the two courtyards, at best. I mean, last time it had a map. This time it does not. But now that we've gone through it, we've cleared the spider webs up. That's away from here, so we can go through to uh, this way now. Uh, but since it's useless to us, it's all irrelevant. Pencils ready. And we're done with our warp point. We are not done with the Song of Time, however. Run, boy! Faster! Yeah, 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 shadows. Let's go this way like before. Then the puzzle here is a little different. Because now we need to activate the torch with that pressure block. Block which needs pressure left on it, so we need a box. Aha! Got 
가자. 알라이트, 나우 위 가라. 스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스스
take this path back into the center. And for anyone wondering how we're doing... Yeah, we're all but clear. Hello, sir! Now, which one for starters? You! More should do it. Yay! Give me those. Now this puzzle actually also works exactly like before. Just push it counterclockwise. Now we'll be able to pick up all the loot along the way. Job! Double kill! <laughs> and that will push things back into its starting orientation. What's this? Nothing here? Flies! And that is that. All we have to do is beat up Phantom Ganon and everything's finished. Aha! Now where is he? Ah, oh, there you is. Hey buddy. I'm gonna rip your face off and do other unpleasant... Okay, fine, you can rip your own face off. I'll still do other unpleasant things to you. Right. Same as before. We are looking for the... We're looking for the guy with the bright armor, which is gonna be this guy. One shot. Nope, not that one. That one. One more shot. <laughs> there you are. Off your horse there, buddy. Fight me! It's only going to take three jump attacks with bigger on sword to finish him off. Yeah. <laughs> 
Man, that one goes fast. Interestingly, the volleys with this guy are harder than the volleys with Ganon. Because the projectiles actually gain speed with this guy. See what I mean? Away with you! Aha! Yeah, except for having to shoot Ganon with the arrow of light. Uh, this guy's the harder fight. <laughs> Seriously. Oh well. That, as they say, is that. Next time, well, we'll, we'll head into the past and deal with the Kakariko well to get the Lens of Truth. We'll see you then. Later.